Hi everyone, I hope that you're having a great day. So it's Saturday and I'm in our house. Sean is right outside mowing the lawn. If you can hear the lawnmower going, he's literally right outside the window. But what I'm going to do today is I am going to start packing up the kitchen. If you're new to my channel, you might not know that my husband and I recently sold our house. So I am getting started with the kitchen. This is the first room that I'm sort of tackling and trying to see what we really need, what we don't need. And I think I'm gonna run out and grab some boxes today so that I can maybe put some things in boxes as well. So um, I'm going to start with the kitchen because I know there are things that we don't use and things that I could definitely donate. Part of me wants to try to sell some of these things and maybe maybe I will try to maybe have a garage sale next weekend um, just to try to actually make some money off of this stuff. But yeah, so I am going to start by going through some of the cabinets and just really decluttering what I know for a fact we won't need and um, then go from there. I'm gonna get started with the cleaning process today the cleaning and packing process. So I'm gonna start by looking in these cabinets right here. This one in particular, this has, as you can see, it's a bit of a disaster in here. This has a lot of our like cooking items, like appliances, big appliances. And some of them we've never used. So I'm going to try to be really honest with myself. And if I know we haven't used it, I'm going to declutter it. Good morning everyone. I started yesterday working on decluttering and packing up the kitchen because I wanted I felt like it was a good place to start and it would be a good place for me to say okay, we're going to keep this, we're not going to keep this and just knowing what items we've used, like what appliances we we have used, which ones we haven't used. I also think it's good to not move expired food. <laughs> so, um I just went through our spices yesterday and I got rid of a lot of spices that were expired. Some of them were like 2014. How does that even happen? <laughs> like they were no good or they expired in 2014. That that means they moved with us. That's crazy. They moved with us expired. So I am going to go through these cabinets right here and I'm going to try to get rid of as many things as I can that are expired, no good, or just things we know we aren't going to be using. I typically like to keep as much food as I can just because, you know, from now until closing, we're gonna try to eat out of the cabinets as much as we can. I just did a Walmart grocery pickup yesterday and I got some like fr like fresh fruit and stuff like that, milk, you know, all of those types of things that we need. But I want to try to eat the cabinets, not literally, but you know, eat everything up in the cabinets before we move so we don't have to put food into storage. What we're gonna end up doing probably is staying with my dad for a little bit, my dad and my stepmom. So we could always bring the food there and then eat it while we're there. So I'm going to start so um, I can show you like right here right over here these cabinets sorry these cabinets over here I worked on yesterday maybe I'll start with the junk drawer I don't know and those are the spices that I'm keeping right there maybe I think I actually am going to start with this cabinet over here this one right here is the spice cabinet what became the spice cabinet so I think I'm going to start with this one and just start decluttering I figured I would take you guys with me today while I do that um, it's so beautiful here in New York today too. I'm so excited. It's just like this cool sunny day. It's been very rainy, so it's nice to finally see the sun. So maybe I'll make it outside and I'll take Finley for a walk later on if he's good. So, all right, let's get to work cleaning out these cabinets.
Good morning everyone, Sean and I are starting to work on packing some boxes and getting some stuff out of the house. I shared with you guys, at least maybe earlier in this video or in a previous video, I'm not sure how this whole moving thing is gonna go, how the whole moving video series is gonna go. So I shared that I started packing up the different parts of the kitchen. I really started just going through things and getting rid of what I know we don't need, things that were expired, that kind of stuff. But for today we're going to start really getting some stuff out of the house and we are going to go to the basement anything that's already in like a bin we're going to we're going to bring to our storage unit which we just got yesterday because if you don't know at the filming of this video we do not have a home to move into we're going to be staying with my dad for a little bit in the process of finding our new home we're going to go to the basement and we are going to start packing up some boxes and anything that's actually already in a bin we're just going to bring over to the storage unit so let's head downstairs all right there is the basement. I have some laundry going. So, this is what the basement looks like right now. We actually went through it fairly recently and got rid of a lot of stuff. And most of our stuff is stored right here under the stairs. So, as you can see, a lot of it's already in bins. We're going to just try to remove some of the bins right now. We might go through the bins and sort of declutter things we know we don't need. So, yeah. So we are going to start by getting rid of some of these, some of the stuff here that's already in boxes and bringing it to the storage unit. Today I'm going to be sharing with you the process of packing up the craft room. It's getting really real. We don't have a closing date right now as of the filming of this video, but it is coming, I'm thinking it's sometime next week. It's just sort of like this gut feeling I have. We are like ready to go and well, we're trying to get ready to go because it's gonna happen anytime. So I'm going to clean up the craft room and get it all ready to pack up. My dad's gonna come over today and help out with that. I have such mixed feelings about this though because this craft room was such a labor of love for me and it was a space I always wanted and it's just becoming really real to, to be leaving it. And um, yeah, I'm just like, I'm looking at it and it's I don't know like I'm just I'm really going to miss it in here I made a lot of fun videos for you guys and we and I don't know I just feel like this room is my like physical connection to you if that makes sense you know this is where I go to talk and to to talk to you and to um, share with you and um, it's just like you know it's become a really special place for me and it's just making me nervous that I'm gonna be leaving it um, I'm I know that wherever we go there will be a place for me to be creative and share with you and to meet you again 